welcome to another video of the CU Play Online. Today we will be discussing a very important topic that is promotional elasticity of demand. The question that we will be looking at is from Business Studies A2 level. This is May June 2015, paper 33, and this is question 4, part A, where they are asking you to calculate promotional elasticity of demand. Now, before we move on ahead, I will just tell you guys that what is promotional elasticity of demand. So, promotional elasticity of demand tries to calculate that how much has the quantity demanded changed as a result of whatever you are doing in terms of promotion or advertising. So, the formula that we use is the percentage change in quantity demanded divided by percentage change in advertising, promotional activity, marketing, whatever they have given you in the data related to promotional spending. So, the important part over here is like for any other elasticity of demand, this is percentage change in quantity demanded and percentage change in advertising. Now, percentage change basically means that what is the rate of change when one value is changing to another value like there is an old value and there is a new value. So, what is the rate of change in both these values? Now, in the case, the information they have given to us relating to this promotional elasticity of demand says increase promotional spending by 1 million to 11 million and sales increase by 5%. Now, we can clearly see that sales increase is already given to us in percentage form. So, sales increase will be our percentage change in quantity demanded because quantity demanded is being reflected by the sales. So, sales increase is already given to us in form of rate of change. On the other hand, the increase promotional spending by 1 million to 11 million. What does this indicate? This indicates that basically the promotional spending has increased by 1 million. That means after increasing by 1 million, this has now become 11 million, which indicates that the old value is 10 million. And whenever we are calculating rate of change, we take the difference between old and new and divide it by the old. So, if the old quantity, if the old value is 10 million and it has been increased by 1 million, that means that the percentage change will be of 10%. So, the percentage change in advertising